Hello and welcome to the first video of my channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to export your Archicad 3D model into 3D Max file. I will be working on Archicad 22 and 3ds Max 2020. So let's go. First of all, Archicad users and architects, including me, need to export their 3D model to 3D Max so they can render it and render still images with the VRA render engine. To do that, we will jump to the 3D window in ArchiCAD by clicking on F3 button. You know that by clicking on F2 button, I go to the 2D window and F3 to the 3D. So I need to be as a 3D window. And for exporting, I will save this file as a 3DS extension by going to File, Save As and choose this, the, the 3DS Studio file. 3ds here then i will go by clicking file save as i will choose some path this is the first one save so here i have four options and the unit setup first of all the unit setup is based on what my unit setup are in the 3d map i use the metric system in 3d map this is my unit setup 3d map metric centimeters and every unit is equal to one centimeter so i need to do in archicad to choose the millimeter here and then i will type here 1000 then i have four options i find out that the second one and the fourth one are the best to export the model so we will discard the first one and the third one i will try the second option which is element types surfaces and I will hit OK for the first time then I will do the same process again but this time I will choose the fourth option and I notice that this option I check it it says object group name seven characters OK and I will go to 3D mark to see the difference between the two models I will click on import select the first one choose open and yes I will delete the unnecessary object this is my model which I use the second option which is element type surfaces I will move it right here then I will do the same process again and import the second object do the same process and here I have my second object which I select the surfaces option while export so now I need to see the difference the first option not think that every object is alone and it's the, the detaching process is based on its type like this is a wall, so it is alone. This is a window, alone. The roof is alone. And to do any material editing for this model, I need to convert it to edit poly, and then to do detaching for the faces, and then attaching, and so on. But on the other file, when I use the surfaces option, I find out that the surfaces are also detached but based on their material so when I select this you can see that I am selecting the whole surfaces that have the same material this the whole walls that have the same material this walls that have the other material so this type of option is much better to use and I recommended it because uh, it gives me more freedom uh, in the material editing process so here the detachment is based on the object type but here the detachment is based on the material so i don't need this 3d model so now i have my 3d model ready and good for texturing and then for rendering in v-ray i hope this video serves you well don't forget to subscribe share and like my videos See you in the next video.